All right, guys. How you guys doing today? We got a D13 uh, head on right here. We're gonna so be showing a uh, component. Uh, this is where your thermostat is located up in front. This is the front of the cylinder head. Thermostat. You got your uh, fuel check valve goes right here. Injector harness is coming in from the front. There's a common uh, leak on these. Just an O-ring that needs to be replaced. You got your intake valve, exhaust valve. Uh, this is where the injector is at. Injector cup is inside. Yeah, Probably too bright, it. no? I got it. Yeah, that's good. And then you got your cam bearings right here. Cam bearings. Uh, common leak on these is on the back side. So if you're gonna go, you know, look at a D13 for your first time, first time purchase, you can see this, it had oil leak on there, obviously. Check both in uh, left and right rear uh, side. That's where they like to love to leak. Yeah, we got your exhaust uh, exhaust ports on this side. This is where your exhaust manifold is mounted. Coolant level sensor, uh, coolant temperature sensor is right here. Right, right here on the lower side of the cylinder head. Exhaust valves, intake, injector cup. You can see it right here. This is where your injector is uh, comes out and it sprays a uh, few into the cylinder. Show you guys. Any common problems with D13s, injector cups? Injectors? Uh, you have a lot of injector cup issues. Uh, either they start pressurizing to the fuel, uh, cooling system or uh, they're not sealing, so hard to start. And then usually when you have the hard to start, it, it's always recommended and you, uh, most of the time you have to replace the injector. You, gotta, you buy a six pack, six injectors, six cups, no issues. Um, also the valve seats, they like to wear out like we got in this one. Way you'll find a, uh, the way you'll find a bad valve seat is when you run the overhead. That's a no-brainer, you'll catch that right there. That's yeah. how we caught this one. This one we can see, uh, yeah. obviously it's, it's yeah. lower. Yeah, this one right here, compared to this one. Or you could just compare these two. Look at that. Mm -hmm. okay. okay, we'll go ahead and uh, we install the new cylinder head on the, on the truck already. Which we're gonna have a separate video separate around video for that one. the whole issue of this thing. So let's jump into that video. Uh, look out for that video on our channel. Uh, thank you for watching and talk to you soon.